Hey guys, what's going on? It's Saturday, May 21st, 2021. Um, I am, uh, it's about 5.56, almost 6 o'clock at night. Uh, I just finished cleaning this bedroom that I sleep in. Uh, vacuum everything. Um, my f- brother and his girlfriend are here. I'm sorry, I am very weak. I have not rested. I have not ate nothing. I drank water earlier. I have not stopped. I haven't sat down since I since I got here, even before that, just to try to get this room in order and stuff like that. They've taken some of my stuff and put it in the garage. They, my brother ha- had to help me because I'm not capable of really going at it. I am very dizzy constantly. I don't know what it is. But I don't know. I, I feel like, you know what, a lot of times, like I said, I feel useless. I really do. You know, it's not that I'm lazy. It's the fact that when this diabetes, I don't know what's going on. I don't know why I'm dizzy constantly. I almost fell a couple of times when I was vacuuming and stuff like that. I'm like, I feel like I'm drunk. I feel like I'm drunk. They went out. They went to Walmart hours ago. And they... I have not got food shopping in about a month or so because I took out so much food because I was, um, you know, cleaning constantly. I never got a moment to, you know, to, um, you know, cook or anything. So a lot of stuff I throw out. So all I have in the refrigerator is eggs, pepperoni, and that's it, and kielbasa. And cheese. And I have then the June. I have to be out of here. I don't know if I mentioned that. So <sighs> I don't know. I'm just Oh I think they're back. They're back. Alright guys. Let me do what I was doing continuously and finish. Hey guys, what's going on? It's May 27th, um, 2021, and, uh, sorry about the noise, um, having the floors, uh, working on the floors, putting down, uh, some flooring in one of the bedrooms in the closets, uh, it's just really been, just been crazy. I'm like, I don't know what's going on. I've got like some kind of allergy or something. I don't know. I woke up yesterday and my throat was like, not sore. It was like sandpaper kind of like, you know, it's like kind of irritated. And then, and then this morning I woke up and my nose was all like, it's been like that. So I don't think, I think it's an allergy. First I thought it was COVID. Um. I had somewhat of a neck pain, headache, but then that went away. So yesterday, the central air conditioning just stopped working. Uh, I was walking outside to the garage to bring something in, and I noticed that the unit was spinning really weird, and it wasn't sounding as it normally sounds when it comes on. And I said, that don't sound right. So I went inside and I checked the thermostat. The thermostat was set to 73. But it said 80, that was the actual temperature inside. And I'm like, oh no, something's wrong. So I think the compressor shot, or it's, uh, I don't know. I mean, the unit might be old. And I think the unit's been here since a year uh, after my parents moved here. So they had just got that put in. So I called last night and they didn't get back to me. I'm gonna try again later, I guess, you know, uh, they have so many people or so many calls I'm gonna try again but luckily today is not a hot day uh, I had to get the fan out I have the fan going on the ceiling fan here and uh, oh my gosh I, I, these allergies or something is just really ridiculous I don't know if it's because we had really bad storm coming yesterday and things got blown around that and I think it might have set something off because I haven't had allergies like this in a really long time 
I got kind of nervous because I thought I was saying, please God, let me not have COVID. Um, and I mean, I haven't been around anybody except for people at church. And I haven't been out shopping or anything. The only people I've been around is my brother and his girlfriend, and they live in New York City. So I'm saying to myself, you know, if that was the case, then I would have got it from them. And I can't afford to be sick. I, my immune system is very weak. And, you know, I don't know. I just think it's allergies. I'm hoping to God it's allergies, especially the dust. I mean, but I've been around all this dust since the, the rugs have been pulled up. And I just get burning in my nose. This is not burning in my nose. This is like, like I guess maybe the pollen might have been high and it might have affected me. I don't know. I'm just like, I don't know. So yesterday I finally uploaded a vlog. Um, it was uh, Buried Alive. I think that's the title. About when um, we had the dumpsters and uh, we threw out a lot of stuff. And it was a lot, as you guys saw. And... Um, so I'm trying to just really keep myself busy because I'm really kind of stressed right now. It's just a little stressful for me. It, you know, because there's a lot of stuff going on that I'm not really wanting to mention. I don't know if I should mention. And, you know, put it this way. I don't even know if I'm even going to say it, but I don't know what to say. I really don't know what to say because I think after all what I've been through, <laughs> I don't know, you know, so I don't even know what to think anymore. It's May 28th, Friday, and the dumpster is being picked up and taken away, finally. And uh, bye-bye stuff, thank God. glad that's all gone um i'm just waiting for uh a friend that's come to uh finish the rest of the floors of the hallway here um so here's some of the actual he finished the uh closet yesterday so here is what um he didn't get to this part but look at what it looks like i really like it I really like the way it looks. It came out really good. Um, I'm gonna be putting trim on the side. So um, it actually, so the floor doesn't, you know, the floor has movement as it floats on top of this. And the closets are all done to here. Looks really nice. Honestly, I wish my parents did this in the beginning. I wish they would have got rid of the carpets because carpets are all, um, you know, dusty and stuff. Here's the other room. Um, that's done too on the other side. That's done as well on the other side. And those are my sheets. <laughs> Um, put them on this bed for, you know, whatnot. I don't know what's going on. Um, I'd say Wednesday I woke up and I had a scratchy throat, like, like almost like kind of like gritty sandpaper kind of thing. You know, like I knew something, you know, it was like, ugh. at first I didn't think it, I thought, I didn't think it was a sore throat. I thought it was something else. So, uh, I, uh. And then I, I, you know, I've been sneezing a lot, but I, I'm sneezing now more, um, and you know, which is really strange. Uh, and I don't know why. Like I mentioned, I guess I mentioned the other day in the other video or yesterday's video. I don't remember when I recorded it. Um, now I'm sneezing even more, and I'm, I have a constant runny nose, and you know. First, I'm thinking, well, I don't have loss of taste or smell. And first, I'm thinking, is it COVID? Um, because, I mean, the, like I said, the only people that I've been around uh, is my brother and his, his girlfriend up from the city. So I haven't really been around people. I haven't gone out food shopping or anything like that. So, 
and I've been around people at church, which is once a week actually, because I haven't been going, you know, I really haven't left the house because of all what's going on here, you know, so I really haven't had time to do anything else. And so, you know, I, it's just probably allergies, which it's very strange. I usually don't get allergies like this. I don't know. And I'm really debating whether I should go get a COVID test and find out if it's COVID or isn't it, because I can't afford to get COVID. I have really, you know, bad immune system. It's just that, you know, this, this virus is real. Uh, it took my dad. You know, I think it's just allergies, but, you know, I, I, I'm saying to myself, I'm like, should I go for a COVID test? I mean, I'm kind of worried. I mean, I don't have any other symptoms. I don't have loss of taste or smell. I don't have headaches. I don't have a cough. I don't have fever. Um, you know, things like this is what makes you really nervous. You, all of a sudden, you know, like the WebMD, you start freaking out. Oh my God, I'm going to die. You know, it's like, no. But I think it's just an allergy. I think the pollen has been so high. And Wednesday when we had real, we had some really bad weather, that day, that morning, was when it got, you know, when I woke up, I had that. So I don't know. It could have been just the pollen high. It, there was a high pollen count in the trees. So I'm wondering if that's what did it. That's what I'm suffering with. But I, I may have to get some Claritin to stop it because... I'm like constantly sneezing and my nose is burning a bit, but I've been around the dust with all the flug, the, 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 fl the rugs, the flugs, <laughs> flugs <laughs> with the flugs, with all the rugs being pulled up and, uh, you know, and all the dust from the curtains and all that around. So, you know, and I'm using, I'm vacuuming in this room. So, you know, I really don't know. <sighs> so, oh, that was a lolly. That was a wallop.